listening wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena absolutely picture perfect for a game of this nature now for a game this between two very high quality sides a treat for everybody here well under normal circumstances this is a massive matchup and i'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away in my experience if the opposition go at it full tilt then you have to reciprocate. We'd like to see excitement and be entertained. But if it does go down the serious route, there'll still be lots to enjoy. So it's away we go then. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, Edinson Cavani. He's a top-class finisher, Peter. There's no doubt about that. But it's his clever movement off the ball that gives him the chances to get his finishes away in the first place. He's a, a big physical presence too, so I'd expect him to make a big attacking contribution no matter what his team's tactics are today. Yeah, he'll be looking for a goal or two. Manchester United can't make any sort of inroad despite all this possession. Davis. Over to the left. Keeps everyone guessing. Coleman with the delivery. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Manchester United have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to It's Lewandowski! A collective sigh of relief from the defense. You lucky boy, you lucky, lucky boy. Giving the ball away like that is usually punished. But Tomine. Fred. Bayern Munich have had plenty of possession, but few, if any, genuine chances. And it's Cavani. Cavani! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Kimmich. Out towards the flank. Koeman. Lovely bit of skill there. Kimmich. Still, rather frustratingly, it is nil-nil. Oh, shooting chance! That's a half-decent try. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. McTominay. Juan Bissaka. Good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Douglas Costa. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Massive leap! And there is the half-time whistle. Bayern Munich. Well, to capitalise in stoppage time, so we are as we were. The midway point of the game. Bayern Munich ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to be maintained in the second half. Interesting half, just missing goals, so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. Ready up and running for the second half. 
Bayern Munich can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. It's Muller! And the follow-up. And in it goes. That's no fluke. It's what he was there for. Our players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great coaching positions. How quick-minded was that? A 1-0 lead established. He's just gone and reminded us yet again of what a threat he carries. And it's Pogba. Your impression so far, Jim? There's a lot of football still to be played, Peter, so ideally they need to maintain a, an attacking endeavour. Manchester United are definitely going about this the right way. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Fred. Bruno Fernandes. And it's Muller. Davis. Coman. Davis. Davis delivers. Hardly anything between the sides. And it's 1-0. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. So that's two now without reply. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Davis, Gnabry, it's got through to him, Chupa Motting, Chupa Motting! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Bayern Munich awarded another corner. Been levered clear, played into the middle. And that's it. A decent win via a very competent performance. Without doubt, they were the better side, and the result reflects as much. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Look, we saw some textbook football from White areas.